Well, five months on, Matilda Gbenyaga has successfully enrolled as a student of the West African Senior High School, hoping to achieve big dream despite her disability. Posha Gabo has the rest of the story. Walking through the compound of the West Africa Senior High School with a sense of pride, Matilda Agbenyege's dream of becoming great in future has just started. When the West Africa Examinations Council, WIEC, released results of the June 2016 BECE, Matilda qualified to be placed in school. However, there was a delay in her placement. TV3 followed up at the computerized school selection and placement system where Matilda was able to gain admission at the West Africa Senior High School. We know the Ghana Education Service is running an all-inclusive system of education now. So we have also incorporated it in our system that we are running. So we make sure that all candidates, provided you make the mark to go to a, a particular school, you go there. So with Matilda's case, she did the exams. She qualified to be placed, and we made sure we placed her in West Africa Senior High School for her to have an inclusive education as we are already implementing. Ghana in 2016 began the implementation of an inclusive education policy. Inclusive education recognizes and responds to the diverse needs of students with special needs, accommodating both different styles and rates of learning and ensuring quality education to all. Prior to starting school, teaching staff and students of the West Africa Senior High School were educated on Matilda's condition. I was privileged to watch the program on TV3 that uh, showed my, uh, us Matilda. At the time, she was writing a BEC, and I was touched indeed. And as if by design, uh, he had been sent to West Africa Senior High School. With support from her peers, teachers and parents, Matilda feels comfortable and is able to participate in class. The servant, the maid, belongs to which class of work? Enough. Enough for Matilda. How are you coping in school? Quite. Quite. So your colleagues here, how are they treating you? <laughs> what? They are treating me good. They help me in going around the school and be together. The headmaster and teaching staff of the West Africa Senior High School have vowed to do all it takes to make Matilda succeed. Sometimes when she's suffering, I, I help her. She's very humble and I like her so much. Do you think she can be who she wants to be in future? Yes, I believe that because she never gives up. She is a very intelligent girl. And when you enter the class, if you are not told, you hardly notice that there's anything or something wrong with her. Five months ago, TV3 brought to you the inspiring story of Matilda Agbenyega. She's now a student at the West Africa Senior High School and wants to be a nurse in future. She has one message for persons with disability that disability is not inability. Matilda, however, wants one challenge addressed. I want to tell my to provide the software so that Doing exam can be faster and easier. Due to her concern, TV3 followed up at the West Africa Examinations Council. Well, anything that the council can do to support special needs candidates, we'll do that. So, I think we'll take we'll, we'll, we'll take that into consideration and see what we can do, which will not benefit only her, but with other candidates in the future who have such needs. Matilda Albanega says she will not let her condition be a barrier to achieving success. I want to encourage parents to send their words to school because if you want to become a successful person in future, it's through education. Porsche Gabo, TV3. Indeed, that's a giant step for Matilda there.